Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. In the last video, we did some things, did a lot of side questing kind of stuff, and I believe this is our final side quest. Yeah, need to know. But I also want to do some jobs. We're going to do some jobs. Jobs are cool. The cannon is what I needed. Hmm. Uh, da -da, we're not doing that, we're not doing that, but I do want to get, say, this kind of stuff. Upgrade the hunter quiver, upgrade the resource pouch. Or grid the potion pouch and maybe the light arrow quiver as well. So, let's do that for... Oh my god, it's miles away. <laughs> oh no, that's so far away. Oh no. No wonder I've not been getting iridescent. Okay, never mind, I'm not doing any of that. That's all nonsense. <laughs> Wait, do I need them not require something silly? Let's have a look. Nope. Uh, okay, this one we can do. We'll do the ones that we can do. How's that for a, a plan? So all we need is some nutritious, delicious carp skin. I say that slightly ironically. We seem to eat the skin on salmon, but no other fish. Why is that? Maybe people do eat fish skin all the time. Gollum eats fish skin. And who are we to judge Gollum? We are nobody to judge Gollum, ladies and gentlemen. Nobody. Alright, remember we learned our lesson last time. <laughs> To get the f oh, we came here before. So we got a cop here yesterday, didn't we? Or today? I have no idea. There we go. Bam. Done. That was easy. Uh, right. And the other one, the J feathers. I thought they'd be back here because we haven't been seeing Jays in a really long time. So I assumed they were in the uh, the starting area in the daunt. I'll tell you one thing. I'm not daunted by what I have to do next. Uh, it's for chair. I'd like to wait. I can't. All right. Yeah, Jay. You're not a Jay. You're not a Jay. None of you are Jay. You're a Jay. No, you're a squirrel. The Jay, are they going to walk around on the ground initially? Are they going to just be flying around? All the birds seem to walk at first. Because obviously it gives you a bit more of a chance for actually getting the blighters. Oh, that bloody crow again. It's a squirrel. <laughs> See, I can't tell. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. What have we got here? Um... No. No. Yeah. That's a great shot. I'm very talented. And sexy. Right, okay. <laughs> Let's grab that. Do we need more? Nope. Sweet. Done. Easy, blimmin, peasy. Unknown workbench, apparently. Uh, yeah, that's okay. I mean, I wouldn't mind heading here anyway. Just see if there's any new quests, you know? They'll be super low level, but you never know. It's what I was saying last video, that maybe it's worth checking out these towns a little bit. See if anything's popped up. I wouldn't expect anything here at Baron Light. I feel like we covered this pretty consistently in the past, but... You never know, folks. You never know. Right, two potion upgrades. Very cool. Pouch upgrades. So, light arrows for our... Oh, and again. Oh, cheeky. That's for our warrior bow. <laughs> it doesn't stop. Okay, oh, now it stops. And then uh, potions. Which is fully upgraded, apparently. A very low level. Alright, cool. And then, we can't do that one yet, and we can't do the other one yet, either. But, um, that's cool. That's cool. I'm gonna get some of this done here while it's um a little bit cheaper. Not quite a lot cheaper, actually. I think it's substantially cheaper to do it like this. The problem is you have to make sure it's things actually you actually want. Yeah, you know, there's a lot of ammo types in the game that you're not gonna be using at any one point. Uh doo -doo -doo. is there any other towns I haven't been to, right? So Plain Song I think is finished. Let's go check out Scolding Spear quickly. I feel like we came back here and we got more quests here already, so we've kind of done this. I want to check Short Scolding Spear. I want to check the Sky Clan town as well. I think just like the main hubs, basically. Okay, nothing here. The last one should be up here somewhere. There it is. What's this place called again? The Bulwark. Love a little poke. 
Oh, fast travel. Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> Just burning through those fast travel packs. And then we're heading southwest. Come to the coast, have a few laughs. It's gonna be great. Not well, nothing here either. No, oh, shut up. You're not my real dad. How did I not get that question mark? We will get that question mark. <laughs> And then we'll go on a quest. I'm just trying to put off the main quest. I thought, oh, we'll manage to put it off for like the entire video. I have to do it right now. Not that I don't want to do it. I just like side things. Side things are cool. I had a little look at how long it takes people to beat this game in the first place. Ah, this is why we didn't do it. Although, I would have seen it if I knew what it was. Um, and <laughs> for the actual storyline, people are talking like 28, 29 hours. Now, bear in mind, we're at nearly 50 already. So on how long to beat, there's three definitions for how long it is to beat a game. There's uh, just complete the game in a general sense. There's completionist, which is absolutely everything. And that's about 80 to 85 hours. So I, I think I've been playing in the completionist style. So probably 70 to 80 hours for my playthrough. Oh. I love it when you knock a question mark off the map. It's just a nice feeling. Let's go grab that one as well. And then about 50 hours-ish for main story and extras, which I think is like, do the main story, do some side quests and stuff like that. I don't know, it's not a hard and fast definition, but it's just interesting. I don't necessarily always feel like I'm doing a completion this playthrough, but I suppose I do try to pick up every question mark and I do do every side quest, so, you know, how more completionist can you really get? Other than like trying to gather every... I think completionist would probably tend to mean doing every achievement as well. But I think inherently by doing what I'm doing, I'm kind of going towards every achievement, right? Even if inadvertently. Oh! Whoa! Hello! <laughs> Things about that. Bam! Bam! I'm doing a thing. I'm bamming. Bam. Bam. That's my warrior bow super duper special ability. Great hit. Guess you're curious. What is that? Okay. No stamina. Cleanse potion. Oh, that helps. Never done that before. <laughs> Alright, you, buddy boy. Come on, where have you got? There we go. Wait. Right, uh, sure. Oh, stamina. Oh, no. I undervalued stamina for. Oh my god, so many of them. What? undervalued stamina for so long, I'm aware of that. <laughs> it's, uh, oh, you know what? This is actually a good time to do this. I swear half the time she does not swap to what I tell her to swap to. <laughs> Got my boy! Seems to be stuck in the trees. Ah! Oops, it is. Ah! Ah! 
I'm using acid. I swear this happens constantly. Get him, buddy. And technically, because this is a claw strider, I can keep it now. So, is this how this works? Basically, because this is a claw strider and it's a mountable one, it's now permanent, essentially, right? If I want it to be. It's now it just becomes my mount. Where if I said if I'd done that with How did you get over here? <laughs> If I'd done that with a non-mountable robot, at some point it would be turning back to fight me. I gotta say, it was pretty helpful though. I did not expect three Acid Claw Striders <laughs> along with the freaking Ravager, which I also did not expect, so... Who's a good robot? Who's a good robot? You're a good robot. He's a good robot. Those, um... Cleanse potions are actually pretty useful, isn't that? Wanna burn through these little baby ones. Do, 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 do. Tower of London Relocation. London, February 3rd, 2050. The Mayor of London and Government Ministers are due to meet with engineering companies today to discuss the contentious relocation of the Tower of London. <sighs> a centre for English history, the Tower was once a major draw for tourists, but it has stood empty along with other riverside structures since the first of the Great Thames floods. Archaeologists say that the site is suffering from serious and accelerating damage, with several areas of the famous castle close to collapse. Sites currently under consideration for the famous castle's relocation include Hyde Park, Richmond Park, and a new tourist centre at Heathrow. This follows this follows widespread condemnation of the offer by trillionaire Ted Farrow to have the structure safely repurposed free of charge at FAS headquarters in Salt Lake City, Utah, said MP Nigel Tumbling Goggin. They're doing that on purpose to make Britain sound stupid. <laughs> I'd rather have my own head mounted on a spike atop the tower than have our heritage purloined by a beep, 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 beep. They say corrupted. I think it's leaked out more than anything else there. He can't fault Ted for optimism, I'll give him that much. To suggest that Britain would ever let an American take away such a valuable piece of their heritage. Keeping in mind, and I will say right now, that Britain steals everyone's heritage and then loads it into our museums. And our entire museum industry is a testament to Stay in rest. thievery. Push on. Do you see what I see? God, that's very sneaky. Is Yo! It looks like it's underwater. It's called Kappa! And Kappas are cool. But if I can get to oh, floor, the snow! Oh. <laughs> Everywhere I look, <laughs> things are trying to kill me. Can I death from above? No, I call death from above when it's called death from above. Hello, buddy! I didn't think there was anything I needed, but it's been a while since I saw a shell snapper, so. Um, what am I going to do? Right, what are you weak against? Fire will make things easier. I'm going to detach its weapons. That sounds like a good idea. Then we'll use some acid. Acid's better than fire. Acid's cool. <laughs> Tell your kids. <laughs> Boom! God, I don't think he even knows where I am. I don't really want to just sit. This is my problem with this as a technique, however. I don't want to sit here doing nothing. We're going in.
Heartbreaker! I just want the... I need the snap more to stay away for a little while. That's all I really need. I also need to stay out of the water. Water is a death trap. God, it's everywhere. Why is there so much water by the coast? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. All right, we should take care of you. There you go. <laughs> Snap more! What are you weak against? Just take you out first. Right. Alright, get it, you're pissed. We're all pissed. It's been a long day. Stop it! Oh, I should have overridden that. I might still do it. Go on. Nope. Nearly, nearly. I've got a thing, I've got resonance. Eh. Ah. Ah. Nope. Fisk. There we go. I'm just gonna kill it. If I had more health, I'd probably override it there, but. Right, you, buddy boy. Absolutely ages. Is I using acid for that? I was, yeah. I'm not necessarily trying to hit the thing I'm hitting, but I'm trying to get it out of the way. Go, something done. <laughs> God knows what I'm doing, really. Oh my god, it went, it went like through! Did it just hit me? Oh, it's shooting at me with those things. Spray me! Can't believe that miss. I cannot believe that miss. My god. Is that doing no damage? Am I crazy? There we go. <laughs> That's a bloody ages. I didn't realize for so long that that was not doing any damage at all. How cool is that acid effect though? I don't know. I'm kind of screwing around a little bit. Is my excuse. But uh, not an easy fight sometimes. 
Do some looting. Sorry, Pelican, I do need you. Although you haven't dropped what you need, so I'm gonna have to. I'm afraid I need to murder more of your brethren. Not much I can do about it. I haven't made the rules. Just follow them blindly. Let's do a cauldron! I love a good cauldron. I guess this is one we couldn't really do until. Um... Just gonna grab that over there. One, what is this? Sea brine stem. We don't have any of these. I suppose there's going to be a lot of new stuff around here, isn't there? Any animals? Oh, there's some green shine. Okay, okay, okay. It's nice here. The coast, the coast was just, you know, all the beautiful little rainbow fish and yeah, it's lovely. Look at this cheeky little thing. A little, bl a little bit of bloody orange, is this? Right, green shine, which again has not felt particularly important, but maybe it will, maybe it will come together later on. I, f I feel like for maybe somebody better armor in the game, it's going to be more necessary. Better armor, better weapons. It'll be necessary for, uh, you know, for upgrading. We've seen that occasionally. I think one of my weapons needed green shine. I can't remember what it was. It's not one that I use anymore, either way. And no, I'm not getting the spike thrower out of my stash. I don't, I don't, I don't need it. I don't want it. God, I'll play with the weapons that make you happy. Here, yeah, fishy, 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 fishy. I don't know what it is, but I can eat all the fish essentially. So let's just get all the fish. What are you? Where have you gone, little bass? Did I get you? No, you've disappeared into the ether. Hello? <laughs> okay, whatever. Didn't, I didn't want it anyway. Bass for nerds. Shame the lights are rough. So we'll get some good photos in here. Cauldron Kappa. Oh. I can't find it underwater. I'd have to sneak past it. Not a problem, Aloy. Not a problem. Just fall behind it, really. Oh, am I going down? I'm going down. Looks like I can swim down from here. Need a good photo. Eh. I need to be more into the fish. It's important, <laughs> as we all know. That's pretty cool. It'll do if nothing else happens. If I don't get stuck on this small little ridge. Okay, so I've got to assume this will be for like some aquatic type creatures, surely. That's an override. Also, Kappa is a brilliant name for a cauldron. Kappas exist outside of memes, okay? <laughs> Look at this. I, I've got to say, like, I know there's less cauldrons in this game, although I feel like there's been a few of them, but they've been more um, part of the main storyline. In a way that they went in the past. I like snap malls a lot better when they can't reach me. Yeah. Um, but there's more variety in everything they've done in this game, you know. Like this is pretty spectacular looking. I'm very curious if the whole the whole thing can't be underwater, <laughs> surely. It's really cool though. This place. There's 
creating currents in the water. That's something else. There you go. That's a that's a cauldron. <laughs> I'm in. Time to find the core and get those machine overrides. I like that they've still got the lichen, the barnacles and everything growing all over everything. That's pretty cool as well. Big fan of this place. That crate. Might be able to use it to climb onto the ledge. What crate? What do you know about? Is this a crate? What are you? Are you a crate? You could be a crate. A crate. Needs a backup. Try again. What are you on about? <laughs> no, I don't. Should be able to climb up now. I know! Shut up, Aloy! <laughs> I just have a little wonder around. Someone mentioned. Uh. Ow. <laughs> Someone mentioned that this game makes it onto PC, which it will eventually you'd assume, but it's probably gonna take a while. Oh, wait, 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 Maybe. Someone mentioned that um, if this game makes it onto PC, one of the first mods will be to shut Aloy up, basically. <laughs> and they're not wrong, it really will be one of the first things people do. I'm sure it doesn't bother a lot no, of people. No, you don't! But, but it does bother me. Mm, I guess that's not gonna work. <sighs> what now? There's gotta be a way out of this room. Ruse into a false sense of security. There's a way to climb up around here. I need a crate. Don't pull that right on top of me. Is it quicker to... I don't know. Come on, buddy. You and me. And then it's going to swirl around because of the fan. I was wondering why the fan was relevant. You know, like, what, what was the purpose of the fan? And that is the purpose of... Oh, hello. Why spikes now? It doesn't seem like a relevant place for a spike now. That's right, I never missed those in my life. Now I'm constantly missing. Oh god, there's three Apex ones. It's kind of terrifying, actually. Two? I think it's only two. Nice. Well, that was fun. No. It was fun, eh, like. way out of here. I'm not level this place is actually, now that I think about it. Forty? Forty? Madness. Well, so what's this effect? Forty? Bloody Nora. Come on, buddy. Oh. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. In you pop. I think I've hit a snag. No, come on. Ah! Heave, Aloy, heave! Oh. The current's moving the crate. I just need to jump to that rail when the time is right. Wow, this is very slow. <laughs> Much slower than I anticipated it being. Don't tell me to jump now, Aloy. It's the slowest thing in the world. You do not need to help me. Thank you. There we go. Man. Man, so pretty. Pretty, pretty. Pretty, pretty. <laughs> of 
grab some herpa. And in we don't go. That's actually not the right way. <laughs> <coughs> I was all ready to walk into the light. Am I just gliding across here? Probably. Let me just. I should be able to glide down there. Aloy, I know. I'm just looking around to make sure. God damn it! <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> it's really only in cauldrons that she becomes super annoying with it, you know. And I know I complain about it a lot, but it's really egregious. I, I cannot believe they thought it was a good idea. Grumble, grumble, grumble. Time to catch a ride, I guess. I'll try to show. Oh, the lighting. <clears throat> There's the core. Now I just have to get to it. That is a place you saw us. It did seem that I got here too early. Too I'll easily. It was never gonna let me get away with that. Oh, damn it. Ah! Always looking for that down the face hit, you know? Snap well, it's already on to me, I'm pretty sure. Run away! Oh, bear in mind as well, that's doing less damage than more stealth, I think. I think so, I don't mind. I hope so, I don't mind, because that's kind of been the foundation of what I've been doing, so. Right. I just, I feel weird leaving things alive, you know? It just feels like wrong somehow. Like I'm cheating the game a little bit and cheating myself. You played yourself. Excuse me. It's like that meme. I can't remember what it was. Someone who posted that really obnoxious comment. Someone posted something like they had to cheese a little bit to get through. I think it was Dark Souls or something like that. And then the guy posts that comment about you played not the game, only yourself. You won not, but not with honor. Blah blah blah. Went on this massive tirade about it and became like a a may may, as they say. That was weird. Looks like I can climb up this way. Okay, that was strange. Oh! Oh no, it wasn't strange! Okay, all I need to do... Is position myself. Nothing else, fall down this please. Like some kind of... gate. I wonder what it's used for. Probably opening and shutting, Aloy. <laughs> ho 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 ho! Probably to let that bloody place you saw out. <laughs> It's interesting because there's a few rubits that we have. Over there. Too bad I can't override it from here. Like the shell snapper, <laughs> and now the place you saw both of those last time we fought them, we had we had company, we had help, and now that we're further into the game, this is the first time we've done it solo. You know. Can't reach the core from here. I'll have to keep going and hope there's another path to it. I knew this was too bloody easy. Which <laughs> is. Pump for what? This will break my fall.
It's pretty cool. I mean, let's call it emotion. It's hard to tell. I think it might be hard to tell what that is via thumbnail. Just big hunks of metal, really. That does look awesome. Turn around, you dumpty. Turn around. <laughs> Look at me when I'm talking to you. Thank you. Down the gullet. Again, that's not a mechanic. It's Don't not like a particularly finish. fancy mechanic. Don't get me wrong. Than the normal one. But um, it's not a mechanic we had until now. I like when they mix things up like that. I don't know if I've ever seen one of those. <clears throat> Gotta remember to keep scanning things, because there's always just all those different variants, especially with the Boris. There's like 20 little bloody things. <clears throat> Wait, Nora. must be pumping it in. At this rate, I'll be able to swim my way to those overrides. If I can just find my way to the core. <laughs> hey. Going back down there? There's a chest over there, so I'm assuming so. Okay, so what's over here though? <coughs> or just loot, I guess. Or absolutely nothing! <laughs> That's weird. Usually there'd be a little chest there. Maybe that opens up later on. Oh, that way. You stay up now? Can I climb them? <laughs> there we go. Good job, Ayla. Nothing over here, right? Oh, yep. Yeah, hello. Not quite sure what I need you for, buddy, but I need you for something. I gotta take a step back. Uh, right, so we can drag it over there. Right, let's, let's just... Right, tell you what. It probably has to... No, never mind. <laughs> we'll come back later. We'll need it for something, but... Until I find out what we need it for. Not much point dragging it around. Not see any movement in the water. get over there. It's probably to get over there. Alright, come on chest. You and me, buddy. Wait, this is going to be really... How am I going to get it over there? Not a clue. We'll figure it out. I don't want to push it into water. I mean, you must be able... It must have to go in the water, because if it didn't have to go in the water, then you'd be screwed if you put it in the water. You know what I mean? That's if you can actually... Where's this meant to go? Maybe it's just to get it out of the way, actually. You know, for the, uh... 
for the loot. You're not meant to take it anywhere. Or maybe you're meant to climb up there. <laughs> That's the spot. Should be able to climb up now. I don't want to hear a word about that. Thank you very much. Not a word. <laughs> The water with the last one. Maybe I will, Albert. Maybe I will. My chest! <laughs> there you hello, buddy. And the water stopped. That tunnel looks like it leads out of here. How to reach it. With my boy. Wait, now how am I with my boy gonna get out of there? I don't think my boy can get out of there. Uh, nah, it doesn't look likely, does it? Need to create some distance first. I need to find something that'll help me get to that rail. I mean, seems like it would be the chest, but I don't see how I'm gonna get that round. I don't Where's think that? this is gonna help. Oh my, shut up. <laughs> I should have a little poke around first. No, I think it. I think it must be. I don't see anything else. Don't think I'm getting this thing out of here. There has to be another way to get it to that rail. Can I take it underwater? Can I? Let me try this. No, because I can't use my bow underwater. Hmm. I actually don't know. Oh no, I'm gonna need help. <laughs> Aloy, help! <laughs> I take back everything I've ever said. I can place the crate where I need it. Oh right, yeah, okay. I didn't know I could overweight. See that's that I understand I didn't know what to do, but on the other hand hack the switch below to Yeah, we have to go down here. On the other hand, there's been no indication that I could read like undo this, you know what I mean? I guess it makes sense. So. Problem. I'd have got there eventually. I have to believe that. <laughs> Should be able to move that crate now. Come on, crate friend. So where's the thing? That, that's that's problem number two. I actually don't know where I'm moving it to. Is it there? No, it's there, right? It's there. It's there. Heave. Yeah, won't work this close. That's probably what this little gap is for, really. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Let's go with yes. To raise the water level. Yeah, looking good. Looking good. I need to raise the water level again. <laughs> Use the crate to climb up to that tunnel. Ah. Uh, thing anything. At the end of the day, I did need the help. I guess I have to. Do I have to find another way up? But how do we? Hey with me. This is the dead end from before. How did I get up the foot? Oh, the fans. The uh, vents. Yeah. Those wings holding up? Uh, nearly. Nearly only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades, though. Is that the same? It's something like that. Something about horseshoes, something about hand grenades. Because you use hand grenades instead of horseshoes, and therefore it's easier, or something. I don't know, I never really understood the reference, I have to Google it. <clears throat> Crate. 
Just stay where you were, okay? You and me, we're gonna do this together. It's a warning to all the other crates out there. This is my crate. Here goes nothing. Oh, so close. Should be able to use that crate to climb out of here now. Thanks, crate. Everyone say thank you to the crate. Place looks busy. Apex Shellwalker. And scrapper. Back. Give me a second. Give me a second. Oh, looks like they called for backup. You spray me. Are you meant to be a skull. It's always looked like a, not really like a skunk, more like a armadillo. But the spray was very skunk esque, you know? I swear those buffed me though. I swear I got bu bonus damage. Or less damage? Unsure. Actually, unsure. Cool effects. That's all I'm looking for. I don't have stamina for that. Now to find a way back to the core. Lovely. Those shell walkers got annihilated. I think, um, I need to double check. Yeah, I think, um, you need to make sure you've got at least a couple of arrows. I think it fires up to a number of arrows. Let me double check. Yeah, use up to three arrows. So you need to make sure you've got at least three or you're not going to do as much damage. And I think, I don't know for sure, but it felt like loads of stuff broke off and that's part of why it did so much damage. I think part breaking does help. I'm not sure on that. Not 100% sure. I'd have to Google. For the next fight. Do some looting. It's quite a long cauldron, this actually. It's a very video gamey cauldron. <laughs> Every time I'm anywhere near the finish line, it's like, nah, nah, I don't think so, buddy. I don't think so. Okay, there's a crate. Where's there a crate? Probably not for there. I'll have a little poke around first. <clears throat> okay, another weird dead end. And that's clearly the way to go, but I think I need to get up there first. How do I get... Okay, it's over there. Never mind. It's less complicated than I thought it was going to be. Come on, you! That is not an easy angle to move that crate from. Aloe is hench, <laughs> to say the least. I can climb up from here. Damn it. 
I was hoping one would come past just at the right time so I could like not stop from running, you know, it'd be a nice dramatic moment. But I can jump on those metal carriers from here. I'm gonna suck off some drama, what can I say? Oh, that nonsense. Oh, that's new. <laughs> God, I must be getting ready to release it. I need to get to the core fast. I wonder if I can def from above, from here. I mean, it looks like I could carry on going, in theory. But I saw the opportunity and I could not resist. It's weird though, that you can... It looks like you can continue, usually that would be a point where it would knock you off. Maybe this is just wrapping around now. Nice. Yeah, I need to go back. From, I've got 25 large health potions in my stash. I should really be using those, you know. I can't Here fight we that thing go. With this water. Oh. I need to hurry. Huh. Well, that was nightmare fuel. <laughs> my luck. That thing's not gonna let me get anywhere near the core. I need to lower the water level again. At least give me a fighting chance. That was cool. I saw that note before. Maybe you can help me out. Oh, it's right here. I don't need you for anything, do I? Hello, buddy. You're very cool. Swim, my leg, swim. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. This is how we swim. See what it does. It's not like it can make things worse. I need to find a way to the room I was in before. It's the only way to lower the water in here. Where there? Don't worry about it, Aloy. Not a big deal. It's quite cool how this is. I don't really think of this as a game of exceptional level design. It's all very well crafted and beautiful and everything. Don't get it wrong, but it's not like a. Again, I love to mention it so often, but I think like Dark Souls and stuff like that, and the way the levels all loop around and how they're all interconnected, and it's like some beautiful level design. And I never really get that feeling with this game because it's it's very very open world. It's very hard for it to be similar to that in any way, really. But I quite I'm quite impressed with how this looped around like that. That was that was a pretty cool. The the, the way the whole thing came together actually, I think was pretty great. Oh, this is pretty sweet. <laughs> on my terms. Here we go. Got a scan on. Oh god, it's an apex. Jesus. Right, frost and lightning. Clipped it. Just try this out. Nah, I shouldn't have done it much. Frost, I think. Ah! What are you doing? S stop it. Okay, I want to break that on the back, obviously. Stop this nonsense ASAP. Ah! <laughs> Thanks very much. Some of that sweet, sweet bonus XP. There we go. Cool. I don't need this right, do I? Tide Ripper. 
I think so. <clears throat> Just focus a little bit, if you don't mind. things on it so it's activating the purge water. Not that it matters anymore because it's just trying to smack me ever since I took out the thing. Oh. I don't really know what taking these next sacks out does to be honest but we're gonna do it. Trying to really take out those side bits. All the sacks must die. Kind of exposes the core. So do it for me. That's interesting. I thought about that before. Oh. Alright. I thought I could just about walk out of that. That's wrong. Hey! There we go. We're done here. Time to get those overrides. Hey, buddy. Frickin' Apex? Frickin' Apex? Right. <clears throat> Do some looting. We're not gonna get to override. Can we override a Tide Ripper? That would be pretty cool. I find... I don't know if I'm crazy. I don't know if I'm better than I used to be. Or this game is easier. But I swear... I in the first game. I found the first game harder. I remember like fighting against a Thunderjaw in a cauldron and it taken me ages. Like I found it a really hard fight, you know? I, like I really, really struggled. Am I just prepared better now? I don't know. I actually don't know what the difference is, but I haven't really felt like I've hit a wall. Like it's a perfectly, it's not an easy game. I think if like games of a certain age would struggle, blah, 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 or a certain skill level to an extent. I think I'm only playing on normal difficulty, aren't I? Am I playing on normal? I think so. Yeah. Oh! No. <laughs> I kind of wish I played on hard from the start, but it's definitely not an easy game anyway. Even on normal, really. But it feels easier than the first game. 
but only now. Like, initially, it felt quite difficult, because there's a lot going on in this game. This game has so many different systems at play, you know what I mean? There's, there's a lot of different things that you have to kind of remember. These machine overrides should come in handy. What are we going to learn? Rock Breaker, very cool. Tide Ripper. These aren't even partials. Tremor Tusk. <laughs> Stormbird. Oh, these are high-level ones. Jesus. I'll have to restore some of these overrides. Nearly a Thunderjaw. Nearly a Slitherfang. Nearly the Dreadwing. Another mystery machine. Is that a Spinosaurus? Open doors. They should lead me outside. It's a Spinosaurus. There's a Spinosaurus! <gasps> I'm so excited. That's hype. That is super hype. I was hopeful, because we're down at the coast, you know, we've got this whole aquatic theme, and I know the game is pushing the dinosaurs a little this bit harder this time, maybe. Pumping water in and out to release aquatic machines. I was optimistic about the idea of it being a thing, but, you know, definitely didn't know for sure. Man, that's awesome. Oh no, now I want to see the Spinosaurus. Can I get out of this one? Ah. What a beautiful world we imagine too. They're funny cauldrons, because I don't really use the overrides. So in a large way, they're kind of utterly pointless for me. But I still love them. I want to do all of them. I really like this coastal area. It's very cool. Uh, right, that is done. I kind of want to go pick up... Oh my god. Yeah, so I think we'll just head down the coast. We'll grab that. We'll grab... We'll just, we'll just start working our way down this line towards... Wait, what's this? Oh, right, okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll go down there. We'll just start clearing this area out, basically. Do some side quests, do some rebel outposts, do some shelters. You know, maybe there's some cool things to find. Who knows? Uh... Yeah, cool. I need to stretch. I've been taking the week off from workouts, which has made me very sad. But it's because I haven't been recovering at all. And like the inside of my elbows is very painful. <laughs> and my wrists have been super painful. And I'm still in pain, man. I'm getting like really frustrated that I can't work out anymore. <laughs> but I also know I should recover. But then the recovery doesn't feel like it's actually bloody doing anything at this point in time. So... It's all very frustrating. Although my left arm feels... I don't know. Anyways, a fun episode. Very excited to go down the coast, explore these areas, kind of knock out some question marks, hopefully find some new gear. Gonna murder this gold before I go. I've never really killed gulls before, so I need to collect some feathers, you know? Come here, buddy. Look at her, in the sand. That's amazing. <laughs> Thanks for joining me. Cheers much of as always.